Welcome, I'm William Shatner. Business and new markets can open new opportunities and new doors. Let's discover new frontiers in business with this story. In a recent Red Cross survey, more Americans reported that they think they will one day win the lottery than lose their home in a fire. The reality is exactly the opposite. The chance of winning the lottery, one in millions. The chance of dying from exposure to fire or smoke, nearly one in 1,500. Every 24 seconds, a fire department responds to a fire somewhere in the United States. Home fires are very common. Many dangers occur when a fire starts. When you lose a home, you don't just lose a place to dwell. Insurance companies will cover that, but the memories within that home are forever. It's not just furniture, it's pictures, it's mementos, it's your whole life, it's where you might have raised your kids, your pets lived, that's, that's what you lose. You can rebuild it, but those memories don't come back. Survivors of home fires say that it is one of the most traumatic events of their lives. Watching a home where you created lifelong memories go up in flames can be emotionally devastating. Fires can be very devastating for, for survivors because they first question, could I have done something? And fire doesn't always come as top of mind to a human, to anybody. You think, it's, oh, that can't happen to me. So when you look back at it, what are the precautions you could have taken to prevent that? Then you look back at what's left of your house. What are you going to do? Who are you going to call? Where am I going to live? You still have to suffer the fact that you're looking at something that was your home, and now it's not. Despite the frequency of fires, there's hope. Education and public awareness is crucial to preventing home fires. Then, there are simple steps, like installing smoke detectors and having fire extinguishers available in the home, something that nearly 33 million Americans have ignored. There is a lack of awareness to fires uh, in general, other than the fact that there are television shows now based on, on fire departments and everything. Like, people don't necessarily think it's going to ever happen to them. Public awareness needs to be escalated. The recognition that this could happen to anyone at any time, whether it's a residential, whether it's a second home, whether it's your personal business, it's real. Because if you gain that awareness, and when that awareness comes, people will take more precautions be more, more aware of it to get the tools necessary to have prevention and suppression within the household. While awareness and fire detection systems and equipment are vital first steps, they don't always save lives. With advancements in technology, there are innovative ways homeowners can proactively protect themselves and their family and property from the very real danger of fire. Today, we're at Elide Fire USA's headquarters in Peekskill, New York, to see how one company is taking residential fire safety to new heights. CEO and inventor Fana Watnan Kaimart has taken the Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball worldwide. On July 11, 1997, in Phuket, Thailand, Fana Watnan Kaimart witnessed a terrible fire that broke out in the Royal Jomtian Hotel. Deeply saddened by the lives destroyed, this fire was the event that inspired him to develop a better way to fight against fire. With this in mind, the Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball was born. The Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball, a unique, innovative, 24-7 passive active device, goes beyond fire detection. The device actually suppresses and extinguishes home fires. The technology behind the Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball is that it is unique. It is the only passive and active device available. When I say passive, it means it's mounted. It's, it's a fixed device. When flame hits, the ball activates, dispersing a radius of a monoammonium phosphate powder that extinguishes the fire. It's immediate. Within three to five seconds, the fire will be out. This is something totally unique and innovative to the fire suppression prevention business because it activates on flame. So if you're not home and a fire starts, the ball will activate, put out the fire before you get home. So you won't walk home to a house that's burnt down. You'll walk home to a house that has damage, but it will have suppressed and prevented the fire from going any further. Well, I have a, a vacation house on Cape Cod, 
and I was uh, signing up with a rental agent and they needed to put fire safety in the house, smoke detectors, fire extinguishers. Uh, so I went online, I started looking around and I saw I, on Facebook or someplace, I saw the fireball and uh, you know, one thing led to another and I realized it, it's a good extra measure of safety in addition to what the realtor was requiring. This gave me some peace of mind. Or when you're not there, the, the extinguishing ball is there. If the fire breaks out, it will go off, put out the fire. With any fire, the ability to not only save a home, but save a life is often a matter of seconds. The Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball can deliver those seconds, providing an additional line of defense and helping to ensure those precious seconds fighting the fire before firefighters arrive. The Elide Fireball is automatic. It's going to activate on its own. It can be, it's very portable. It could be uh, simply thrown or rolled into a fire. Uh, you don't have to stand as close to the fire and it can be mounted above those areas in a, a home that are known to start fires. Fire statistics show that for far too many, fires can invade our personal space and throw our lives into turmoil. With innovative technology like the Elide Fire Extinguishing Ball, we can take steps to ease your mind so we can ensure that there is truly no place like home. Mark 